बिस्मिल्लाम अस्सलाम वालेकुम डियर स्टूडेंट्स इट्स आर लेसन नंबर थ्री ऑफ इंग्लिश फॉर क्लास सेवेंथ आर टूडेज टॉपिक इज स्टोरी डियर स्टूडेंट्स आर लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ टूडेज लेसन इज टू रीड एंड अंडरस्टैंड द स्टोरी learning outcome will be writing the story it is useless to cry over spilled milk dear students here i'll tell you what is a story story is a tale that is made up for entertainment or a retelling of something that happened or a piece of gossip that is being spread so in simple words we can say that story is a description or an account of incidents or events now we'll see a story map that will definitely help you to write a story basically the story writing has five main elements main characters that means people animals or creatures in a story number 2 setting of the story the time and place a story takes place resolution beginning of conflicts or problems event happening or climax event happening and climax there is a series of events in a story solution ending and moral ending of a problem or conclusion of events so these are the main elements of a story dear students before you begin don't forget to fill index page so let's write our today's index neatly it's our third topic we'll put date and then we'll write down today's topic that is story it is useless to cry over spilled milk students now we are going to write a story the topic is it is useless to cry over spilled milk so prepare your notebook to write a story dear students now we are going to write the story in notebook first of all prepare the notebook page with day date today's task topic story it is useless to cry over spilled milk So let's read together and then we will write down with neat handwriting. Once a hunter had a fierce hound. Once a hunter had a fierce hound. He was a widower and lived with his only child. The man lived alone with his only child, one child. So he had a dog with him. One day he went hunting but forgot to bring his dog with him. On the way he remembered that he had missed his dog. Hunting ke liye jab wo jata hai to usko dog ko ghar chhod gaya ghar bhul gaya. So on the way he remembered ke uska dog to ghar mein hi reh gaya. He returned back to fetch it. जब वो उसको लेने के लिए घर वापस आया वैन ही केम नियर हिज हाउस ही फाउंड हिज डॉग ब्लड स्टेन जैसे ही वो घर के पास पहुंचा तो उसने देखा कि उसके जो डॉग के ऊपर धब्बे लगे हुए हैं खून के ही कैदर दैट द डॉग हैड किल्ड हिज सन गैदर मीन्स ये ही थॉट दैट द डॉग हैड किल्ड हिज सन ही बिकेम मैर विद एंगर and shot the dog dead usko itna gussa aaya ki usne dog ko maar diya when he entered the house he found his son safe and sound he found his son safe and sound jab wo ghar pahuncha to usko apna beta bilkul sahi salamat mila his son told him that a wolf had attacked him but the dog fought with the wolf and saved his son's life uske bete ne usko bataya कि एक वुल्फ ने भेड़िए ने उस पर अटैक किया तो उसने उसकी डॉग ने जान बचाई द हंटर 
रिपेंटेड ऑफ वॉट ही हैड डन अब हंटर को बहुत पछतावा हुआ रिग्रेट हुआ कि उसने ये क्या कर दिया बट यू नो दैट यू कैन नॉट डू एनी थिंग टू ब्रिंग बैक वट यू हैव लॉस्ट एंड इट इज यूजलेस टू रिग्रेट ओवर समथिंग दैट यू डू विदाउट कंसिडरिंग एंड गैदरिंग द फैक्ट्स सो सेम द थिंग ही हैज डन हियर सो द मॉरल ऑफ द स्टोरी इज इट इज यूजलेस टू क्राई ओवर स्पिल्ड मिल्क नाउ यू पीपल विल राइट द स्टोरी इन योर नोट बुक विद इन अ वेरी नीट हैंड राइटिंग विद प्रॉपर गैप Dear students now I'm going to assign you task to do learn and write story it is useless to cry over spilt milk in your notebooks I hope you people have learned a lot from today's lesson thanks for watching the video Allah Hafiz